we're going to be doing undefined matrix products. Now, whenever you multiply matrices together, you're going to want to know what the dimensions are before you get started. And right here, I have R, that stands for rows. So this is going to stand for rows. And I have C right here. C is going to stand for column. So what we do before we start multiplying is we look at the matrix and we ask how many rows does it have and how many columns does it have. For the first matrix, I see that it has two rows and three columns. So this is a two by three. For this matrix, it also has two rows and three columns. So this is also going to be a two by three. And now when you're multiplying, you have to make sure that the inside numbers match up. The inside numbers have to match up because if they don't, the product is going to be undefined. So looking at the matrix dimensions, the inside numbers are going to be this 3 and this 2. And since they don't add up, this product is going to be undefined. Undefined. So looking down here, we're going to try this one next. So how many rows does this have, and how many columns does it have? And for this matrix, find out how many rows it has and how many columns it has. The first matrix is a 2 by 2. That means it has 2 rows and 2 columns. Over here, this matrix is a 3 by 2. 3 by 2. That means that it has 3 rows but only 2 columns. So now the inside numbers are going to be 2 and 3. And since they don't match up, this product is going to be undefined. Undefined. So whenever you multiply, the inside numbers have to match up. Now if they do match up, like let's say we have a 2 by 2 multiplied by a 2 by 3. When you look at these two matrices, Yes, one is a 2 by 2 and the other one is a 2 by 3, but the inside numbers match up. So this 2 and this 2 are equal. So you can actually multiply these two matrices, right? And then what's going to happen is the outside numbers are used for the product. The outside numbers are going to be used for the product. So if I actually do go about multiplying these two matrices, you know, whatever they are, my result is going to be a 2 by 3. It's going to be a 2 by 3. So that's dimensions of matrix products. Remember, the inside numbers do have to match up. If not, the product is going to be undefined, which means you can't multiply the two matrices together. But if the inside numbers do match up, that means you actually can multiply them together. And whatever the outside numbers are, that's going to be the dimensions of the product. So I hope that helps.